Oh, hey, do you guys sell fishing wire? Okay, sweet. Well, what's the longest wire that you've got? Oh, nice. Okay, we'll take three rolls of that. Oh, well, the only reason we need so much is that we're doing, you know, one of those 10-cup telephone things where you attach a wire between two cups. So, we're doing it over a pretty long distance, so... Uh, I'm Matt Belanger, and we're doing a 10-cup telephone. It's gonna be Shane, my roommate. He's over there. He's on the phone. Uh, we have Alex Biard, he's another res, and we have a girl called Jose Guy. It's her room that we're gonna be using. We're gonna take these two cups, attach a string, and then we'll be able to talk into it, and it'll come out the other one. And we're gonna be doing it between two buildings. Uh, this building, and the building all the way over there. So it's pretty far. Oh, I, th I think it's gonna work, but it's gonna be caught soon as challenges. Maybe like the string on the floor, people are gonna tangle with it or mess with it, or even, you know, campus security might come, but we'll see. I think it's gonna work though. Paper cups, these are the best to use because they, they're gonna vibrate more, so it's gonna be better sound quality. And we're also gonna use this fishing line, and we have around 20 football fields of it, so we're gonna have enough. I don't think it's gonna work, man. There's too many trees, there's too many buildings. The success rate is super low. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna be going to Jose's building at the bottom and we're gonna wait for Mac to feed down the string. Shane's gonna wait here and wait till we get the string and we'll feed it to him. But we're gonna wait for that and we'll worry about it later. Now we're just gonna wait for Mac to feed us down a string. Okay, I'm uh, here at the 20th story and I'm gonna start feeding it down. Oh my god. It's already hard. Cause it like turns into the screen. Yo, you're so good. He's stuck in the brand. And we are trying. Hey, how long is it? I'm gonna cut it now because, like, there's no point, man. It keeps getting caught on the vines on the wall. You ready? Yeah. Okay, as long as you can gather all the string, I don't want to make a mess in the trees. Okay, three, two, one. Broken one now. That's broken? Yeah. It's no good. Nothing works, so we're adding weight to it, and it's gonna... keep down. If this down. doesn't work, man. No, no, keep bringing it down. Keep bringing it down. Keep bringing it down. Oh, keep bringing it down. Keep bringing it down. Keep bringing it down. I have it. Yeah. Okay. 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 <laughs> okay. <laughs> Step one completed. <laughs> Am I walking with it now? Okay. Okay, we're walking. How do you think they're doing? What the hell? How did that fall? Um, did you go under? Jesus. Probably off it. I'm gonna cut it now because, like, there's no point, man. It keeps getting caught in the trees. 
So we, we actually finally, we finally got the cord in our hand, but uh, we couldn't do anything because the trees got in the way and they were getting tangled and we just couldn't get it to our place without getting it messed around in the branches. So yeah, yeah so we just gave up. Well, I'm kind of disappointed that it didn't work because it seemed like it was going to. I mean, was, we thought we had everything ready, but uh, we didn't even get to initiate step three, which was me getting ready to to pull up the line to tighten it up and everything. And we didn't even get that far, so that kind of sucked. But we tried our best. I told you. I second the toes.